Hi, this is Victor Gill from the Cisco Security Tag Team. In this video, I show you how to restore a Cisco Security Manager CSM backup. Prerequisites. In this video, I use these devices already installed, configured, and integrated. Windows Server 2012 R2 standard. Cisco Security Manager CSM version 4.22. These steps describe how to restore a CSM backup through CLI. There is a script that helps to restore your CSM database backup from CLI. These steps show you how to use it. Step 1. Make sure the proper backup file is already on the CSM server before starting the restore. Open a command line on Windows Server and enter this command to stop the CSM processes. Netstop CRMTMGTD Step 2. Restore the previous backup file with this command on CLI. This command contains the paths of the per.exe and the restore-backup.pl files, and also the backup file that contains the backup file to restore. In this example, the path is c colon backslash 8. If everything is ok, you receive a restore successfully message when the script finishes to execute. Other optional parameters you can use on the restore command are hyphen t, temporary directory. Restore program stores its temporary files. By default, this directory is $nmsroot backslash tem backup data. Hyphen gen, generation number. The backup generation number you want to recover. By default, it is the latest generation. If generation is 1 through 5 exists, then the 5 is the latest. Hyphen H provides help for this restore command. Step 3. Start the CSM process again with this command. Net start CRMTMGTD. You are done. I hope this video is informative and thank you for viewing it.